Things in Huntsville have continuously gotten messier with each passing day. We all know the castmates have had a tendency to copy one another's ideas. Most recently, Stormy expressed her frustration with Latisha in regards to the website she created for her children's hair products. In a conversation with Courtney, Stormy pointed out that she noticed Tisha's website had a word-for-word -word excerpt of the shipping policies in her website for Canvas Beauty. In fact, one of the sections included the Canvas Beauty email. Oops, in conclusion, Tisha copied Stormy's business website. While Marsa and Tisha discussed this website situation, Tisha defended herself saying that she put the blame on her website designer. This lame explanation removed all the blame from herself and placed it on the website designer. She also said that everyone has been coming for them and it's not fair because she does not talk about people. Tisha's version of events is not sitting well with viewers. As one person stated, first of all, you provide web designers with verbiage for all page blocks. Tell that to your little fans that have no idea about starting a business or website design. Pink accountability, Letitia. In agreement, Stormy said to the fan, exactly. Designers are not responsible for policies. How would he know that? Well, it seems that Tisha and her husband have nowhere left to hide because facts are catching up with them real quick. It is common knowledge that though when putting up a website, the owner provides the words to be displayed. They need to up their game in terms of doing actual business and getting real results rather than maintaining an idea or creating an image without actual results. Tisha has had cringeworthy moments like when she continued to mispronounce Expo saying Spo. Remember when she copied Melody's logo? Judging from the past, it seems that Tisha needs to give a better explanation of things instead of hiding behind her website designer. It's not bad to mention another person as her inspiration and take accountability by apologizing where she did wrong.